When you walk on the golf course, every single shot is really about persevering because there is no perfect shot in golf. You're always trying to recover from where you end up in the fairway or in the rough and just being able to really focus and concentrate on what life brings you or what that next shot brings you is really an important lesson. Well, the first thing I heard was that they were bringing a 10-year-old in who had uh, been hit in the head with a golf ball. I ran to the golf course and picked him up. I got him out of the car and noticed that he was dragging his leg. He was unable to move his right leg, right arm, and weak in the right side of his face. But an area about one inch deep in the brain showed a small hemorrhage. With the injuries that I saw initially, that I would expect him to have significant motor handicaps and maybe some speech handicaps that preclude him from really playing any major sport activities. He grew up seeing all of us compete and all of us accomplishing our goals and our dreams. Arden's a Canadian national champion in the pole vault. I played professional baseball. Arden's father played in the NHL. Knowing Nate, I knew that, that if there was any chance that somebody could pull through, it was going to be him. I don't think he knows a world of not accomplishing your goals. He transferred that into his therapy. So if he didn't do the exercise that he wanted to properly, then he'd come home and try it some more. Throughout therapy, even when he got frustrated, he was just a really, really hard worker. The therapists were unbelievable. Cindy was the head of the therapy, and she took care of him like he was her child. I love Phoenix Children's Hospital. The staff there, the doctors, the nurses were all fantastic, and we, we can't thank them enough. Children's Miracle Network is so important for the hospitals. It really helps to raise money at a local level that's able to give back to the hospitals at 100%. At I, I think it's just a fantastic program. I think hard work does bring good things. I mean, if you work hard and then if you get the thing that uh, you really want, it's like more special because you know you earned it. No one gave it to you. It's all yours. You did it. Nate's had to persevere and really recover from a, from a lot of things with his injury. Uh, being able to regain the use of his hand more and more, being able to regain the ability to walk, talk. And when you're playing golf, it's always about that perseverance. It's about hitting that bad shot and going over and finding it in, in a terrible lie and then being able to make a recovery shot from there, maybe make a bogey and then try to make birdie on the next hole.